Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. With the rollout and release of Microsoft Edge version 95 on the 21st of October last month, in the video I posted on that version update to the browser, I mentioned that citation support had been added to collections. So if we just go over as an example, um, if you have saved a web page or article to your collections, if you click on the uh, menu in Edge version 95, you now get citation support for um, show citations APA7, Chicago, Harvard, REEE and MLA. Now Microsoft says basically um, citing sources for research is a common pain point for students. Managing a multitude of research references and sources is no easy task, let alone translating them to proper citation formats like APA, MLA and Chicago. When left as an afterthought, it can be harder to backtrack and find sources or to format citations correctly. So this is a little handy option um, if you are especially a, a student or a researcher, which can help you um, add those citations to your final reports um, from different web pages as examples. Now, in the latest version of Microsoft Edge Canary, which is version 98, which is a pre-release version of the browser uh, used for testing and experimenting. Microsoft has added another feature for this citation support, which is still in test phase and has just recently rolled out. So if we just go up to our menu in the top right, settings, and we go to appearance, you will see now in Edge Canary version 98 that there is now a new citations button. And if we enable that, we can see now that we have a nice shortcut which gives us our citations and um, button in the top right with all the other buttons and shortcuts um, in edge version 98 it's edge canary version 98 and if we click on it it pops a little side bar and panel where you now have easy access uh, to your citations and this is still in preview so obviously it's it, it could have bugs and won't be as stable as you know um, citations in the stable version but this is now just another little feature that Microsoft is introducing and and basically this new feature in Edge provides students and researchers um, a, a better way to manage and generate citations as you research online and after enabling the citations feature Edge can then automatically generate citations to include as mentioned in any final report that you have on any website. So this is now something that Microsoft is working on in Edge Canary version 98. And you have all your different citation options here. Um, source type academic website where you can add in all the different notes and citations to your report. And we'll just, which as I mentioned, will just make it a lot easier for students and researchers. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching. And I will see you in the next one.